Hello. Let me show you how to model a curved spring in Onshape, like this one, or maybe even something like that, based on the helix, right? Okay, so um, Onshape has its programming language, which is called Feature Script and every user can can write code to define a new command and um, when you look at my structure here you see that i've uh, started with the sketch just some that arc and then there is that 3s 3d spiral one and you might not have seen something like that before so that is a feature script and you can add that to your features here um over here so let's say if i open the drop down you see it here that's that's that command. And I will show you how to import that. Let me get that um, one browse over there. All right, so right now I get this command here. I'll remove it. And just to show you how to edit, I write in the search uh, window spline extension. Spline expansion, right? I open that. I go here and to that and edit custom feature 3d spiral was added to your toolbar All right okay i don't we don't see it here but it's right here now for the modeling of that curved spring let's start a sketch on the front plane with a um, um, arc here like that press P to get those planes out of the way make those endpoints horizontal to the origin give it a dimension of 122 and then exit the sketch and go into our command here, 3D spiral, pick that edge and um, type in those values, 34, number of revolutions, 26 all right take some time all right so we get a our curve then let's define a plane with a curve point that one and that curve all right start a sketch on that plane um, a circle diameter is eight and make that coincident with that starting point go into sweep take that sweep path or curve take some time okay Press P again and 
there we have that curved spring, right? All right, so let's model that. The next um, curve, the next spiral that follows that helix and the very same part studio. So um, start a sketch on the top plane with a circle here. Make those maybe vertically constrained to the origin. And well, if you like that example there, let's dimension that circle with 144 at a distance of um, 200. 88, 288, all right, let's extrude that as a surface, here, surface, that edge, which is 640, and let's um, design a helix on that cylindrical face with one revolution. Now again, let's um, go into our command. Take that edge and um, give it some 34 millimeter radius and 34 number of revolutions. All right, hide that surface, hide that um, curve, create a plane curve point. There is the curve, there is the point. Start a sketch on that plane. Um, dimension that circle with eight millimeters and make it coincident with the end point. Go into the sweep. Take that path, that one. Wait a little bit, okay. Can't do that. Accept that. And have a look at it all. Curve one. Number two. And, and that's it for importing a feature script in on shape and designing curved spirals. Well, I hope you liked the tutorial and talk to you soon.